Hi all, welcome back to the shop. I uh, just finished to make the drilling operation for the holes. Uh, I guess you can see. So it crossed the support. And the next one is here. So the back side you can see here. And the last one is here. So <clears throat> it works pretty well and um, I just have to put some coating because with the, the drilling operation uh, some of coating has gone. Um, I have two or three marks here to, uh, to remove also and put uh, more coating. And the next step will be to take this guy here. I don't know if you see uh, so the shiny colors mean that uh, it's still in a curing process. So I will take this guy, flip it over and put on this one. Then to find the proper position, um, indeed, um, the receiver has uh, more distance on the back than in the front there. <coughs> so I, I have to to put it in the proper position and that I will do, I, I will make a tool that cross the support here and uh, with this tool uh, I will use it uh, to make the center drilling operation uh, from the back side, so underneath and uh, it will be very accurate and after just make some uh, drilling from the back side with a very small bit, drill bit I can work then after from the from uh, the top side that would be more easier to to have the good uh, the good position. So here it is the plan. Um, I have I am thinking about uh, one thing. So this plate, the main plate here in the middle of this guy, will be in contact with the supports. The two other one will not be. But that I have in my mind, I, I will put maybe some rubber between the supports and the receiver uh, because I'm a little bit afraid about the vibration we can have regarding uh, the machining. So uh, I think with the rubber it will be maintained in, in, a pro pro in proper position and uh, with the screwing operation it will make like a, a shock absorber. And on the CSC. So uh, I will make some testing about that, some research on the web. And um, I think it could be a, a good plan for, for, uh, for the receiver because uh, if I only put the receiver like that, uh, unfortunately I can have some, some back welding uh, to touch the support so it will not be very flat. And if, if I put some rubber, it could be a, a good thing for that. So, I will share uh, in the next episode about, uh, about that, and uh, uh, it's pretty good, and it will be better with the, with the receiver uh, in place. It will be a pretty big machine there. See you guys! Thanks for watching guys!